eyes that can see into the future or eyes that can see into the past? Hmm. Choose. I know no wanna. Choose. Here, Brianna, I have a cookie. What's in the cookie? Cookie. Mmm. Yummy. Mmm. Yummy. Brianna, are you okay? This cookie's dangerous. Oh! My cookie. You should be thanking me, Timmy. I just saved your life. I'm heading to work now. Bye, Mom. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She... Mom, don't go to work today. Why? I have to... Just please don't. Okay, I won't. Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because... Hello? This is Officer James. I'm calling because something happened to your mother. She was taken by a strange man at her workplace. We don't know the identity of the man, but we're doing everything we can to find her. Well, is she still missing? Uh, yes. Then you're not doing everything you can. Brianna, I overheard your call. Are you okay? Where are you going? I'm going to find my mom. I'll come with you. Come here. Jake! Help, help, Brianna! I'm going by myself, Jake. Don't follow me. Come on, I show me something. Why am I in my childhood home? Mom! Mom! Are you okay? I I Who did this to you? No, no, I wasn't done yet. Come on, I show me more. Any luck finding your mom? Jake, I told you not to come. It's not safe. I was worried about you. Come here. Jake! Help! Help! Brianna! One, two, three, four. Somebody's knocking at your door. Who's there? Who are you? How did you know that? Five, six, seven, eight. Answering the door will be a mistake. <gasps> Sweetie, did you already finish studying? Yeah, Mom, I'm done studying. I'm just heading to bed, okay? Just keep that door locked. Brianna? Yes, sir? I need you to come see me after class. We need to talk about your grades. Okay, yeah. You asked to see me, sir? Your grades have been declining exponentially. One, two, three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door! One, two, three, four. Somebody's coming to the door. Somebody's coming to the door. Excuse me? I need to lock that door! What are you doing? Someone's trying to get in. I'm going to open the door. No, 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 you can't. You don't understand. I understand. Now move out of my way. Five, six, seven, eight. Push him through the door before it's too late. No, no, no. Let me in. Open the door. Let me in. Open the door. One, two, three, four. It's safe now to go through the door. Brianna, have you seen our teacher, Mr. Stevens, anywhere? No, I haven't seen him anywhere. Huh, weird. One, two, three, four. Don't open the door. Don't open that door. Bro, but they're knocking. Here's your exam paper, Timmy. Um, miss, I forgot my pencil. Well, then I guess you'll just need to be prepared to die. What? No, why? You could just, like, lend me a pencil and I can write my exam. Oh, Timmy, Timmy. Let me tell you a story of a boy who forgot his pencil. No pencil, no right exam. No right exam, fail. Fail, no college. No college, no diploma. No diploma, no work. No work, no money. No money, no house, no food, no lab. But don't worry, just this once, I'll lend you a pencil. <laughs> Are you crying? No. Let me tell you a story about a boy who cried. I got you the new dolly you wanted. Thank you, I love- Stop. You can't ever say I love Y-O-U. If you say it to someone who's not your soulmate, you'll lose all memory of the person you said it to. Hey, baby, I got you lunch. Aw, thank you, babe. You're amazing. I think it's time for us to say the L word. But Evan, what if you're not my soulmate? I don't want to forget you. It's okay. You don't need to forget me. I'll just say it then. I love you. Evan? Um, who are you? How do you know my name? I'm your girlfriend. I don't even know you. You're not my girlfriend, you bitch.
Hey, Emily. Evan told me he loved me today. Brianna, that's great. He forgot me. Oh, no. I need to make him fall for me again. Even if we're not soulmates, I don't want to lose him. Damn. Emily? Evan? Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. Love you. Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. Love you. No, Brianna. Brianna. Hmm? How do you know my name? Uh, I'm not sure, but my name's Emily. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hey, Brianna, I really like your sweater. It's so cute. Thank you. It's new. I just bought it. My ex just came in. He told me he loved me today and then forgot me. Whatever. Don't worry about him. You deserve so much better. Thanks, but how would you know? You don't even know me. I don't have to know you. It's obvious. Did you see? Evan was looking at you the whole class. Whatever. He lost his chance. Hey, Emily? Yeah? I never forgot you. What? Let's play a game. Selected. Why would you do that? One of us is going to die now. Yes, but one of us is going to get money. What game are we playing? A game of odds. Heads or tails? Tails. All right, I choose heads then. Oh, no, it's tails. Uh, a redo? Just the granola bar? Yes, how much? Let's play a game. Selected. What game? Go fish. The ten of hearts? Go fish. <sighs> Joker. What? How did you know? You're a cheater! Mom, I'm home. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. One of us is going to die now. What game? What? You need to choose a game. You need to choose one you're good at. So that you can live. No, I don't want you to die. Sissy, just choose a game. Okay, how about we draw toothpicks? Whoever chooses the shortest stick loses. This is a game of luck. You're supposed to choose a game you're good at. I don't know what game I'm good at. You choose first. I got the short stick. Wait. Let's play a game. I want to make a deal with you. If I win the game, you spare my little sister. But if I lose, you kill us both and you get double the prize money. Deal. What game are we playing? Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. scissors. Here's your dinner, Miss Applewood. Susan, what is this? It's your pureed meal. No, no, get me chicken nuggets. You can't have chicken nuggets. You can't chew them. This looks like what was in my diaper this morning, Susan. And this? It's puree tofu. It's doo-doo. I want chicken nuggets. No. Susan, I want chicken nuggets. You're not getting chicken nuggets. Thank you for the roses. Thank you for the roses. Mmm, <coughs> ice cream. Miss Applewood, we have a new resident on our floor. Susan, I am working. You're 103 years old. You don't work anymore, Miss Applewood. I really want you to meet this new resident. You'll really like him. I don't want to meet him. Tell him to leave. He lives here. He can't leave. I really think you should try making friends, Miss Applewood. Fine. Hi, I'm Mr. Stevens. Hi, I'm Miss Apple. What? Susan, I'm in love. You have a husband. Mama, I'm in what love. What is she doing? With the this is how she flirts. Miss Applewood, I left you some markers and some paper so you can color. I have to go get some work done, so just call me if you need any help, okay? Okay, thank you, Susan. I will. Help! Help me! Help! Miss Applewood, what happened? Susan, I was lonely. Look, everyone, this poor old lady is eating lunch all by herself. Are you recording me, Jennifer? Old age is so beautiful. Who are you calling? Ah! Oh, get over here, Grandma! Is that what? No! To me? Good morning. It's time to take your medicine. Bombastic side eye. No, Miss Applewood. There'll be no side eyeing today. Now take your medicine. <sighs> you really thought you ate that? No, I don't. But you need to eat your medicine. No, I don't want my medication. 
I want girl dinner. After you take your medicine. Girl dinner. No, please don't start singing again. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. All right, unplug your life support. Miss Applewood, you soiled yourself. Come on, let's go and get you cleaned up. No, I'm in my pooping my pants era. What happened to your clean girl era? Let's bring that back. Clean girl aesthetic. Exactly. Now let's go get washed up. You're giving me the ick. You're giving me the ick because you smell so bad. Where'd you get that? What are you eating? My husband. Today we will be making our last girl dinner. Miss Applewood, are you on your phone again? Your grandchildren don't want you to have too much screen time. Mind your business, Susan! What is our dessert? Moldy muffins. Yes, that's my favorite food. I need my glasses. Cake? No, no, no. Too sweet, too sweet. Need some mold on it. Pizza? No, no. Too cheese. Too much cheese! No! Yes. Yes. Toenail clippings. What's my drink? Wash it all down with the 7-Up. Good. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. How much? Delectable. Red olives, all right. No, 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 no. I'm not taking my vitamins. Miss Applewood, you need to take your vitamins. No, I told you I'm not taking my vitamins, Susan. <sighs> See, this is why I told you to stop yelling so much. I don't yell. Anyways, scrumdily umptious. Miss Applewood, your grandchildren are here to see you. Tell them to go home. I'm busy. You're not busy. I'm trying to see what kind of dog I am. Today I will be seeing who has a crush on me. Six, five. I would climb that like a tree. Miss Applewood, what did you just say? No one's talking to you, Susan. Bartender, I don't know because... I'm a material girl. He doesn't make that much money. Cancer. Oh, he's a 10 out of 10 in looks. <laughs> no one would ever have a crush on you, Miss Applewood, because you're not a very nice lady. That's not true, Susan. I have a husband. Now, what is this filter? I'm a fan. Hmm. Why are you spinning? I don't know, but make it stop! Mrs. Applewood lived a long life, but unfortunately, one dreadful day she turned into a fan, and she couldn't stop spinning. Not even Susan could he pee her. Give me now! Bombastic side eye. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Slay. It's worse than I thought, Doctor. Her dementia's progressing fast. All she can remember is internet sayings from back in her day. My name is Jeff! It's not looking good, Susan. Let me ask her some basic questions. What's 9 plus 10? 21. This isn't good. She doesn't even know basic math. Miss Applewood, do you remember me? What's my name? Who am I? You're a pain in my ass. I'm about like the Barbie. Susan, play Barbie World. Nurse Susan's not on this floor anymore. Who are you? I'm Nurse Jennifer. I'll be taking care of you from now on. No, 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 no. Get Susan. Get Susan. I don't want you. I want Susan. Susan doesn't want to see you. Now take your heart medicine and vitamins. I don't take my medicine, and Susan knows that, and she knows I don't take my vitamins. I want Susan here. If you were nice to Susan, she wouldn't have requested to change floors. <sighs> Whatever. I'll go get her myself. Miss Applewood, no. Hey, stop running. Dirty dead. Oh, the enjoyment. Miss Applewood, it's time to take your heart medicine. Susan, you came back for me. I had no choice, Miss Applewood. Nurse Jennifer quit because you hit her with a tray. Good times. That wasn't very nice. Now take your heart medicine. No, 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 no. I don't take my heart medicine, and you know that. If you don't take it, you could have a heart attack. I don't have heart attacks. <gasps> oh, no. <gasps> Miss Applewood. <laughs> That's not funny. That's not something you should joke about, Miss Applewood. <gasps> not again. Susan! Susan! I'm not falling for it. If you were mine, i give this Miss Applewood. Ah! The other residents are trying to sleep. Susan, I was I told you, no performances after 8 p.m. You should be resting anyways. You just had a heart attack. I don't have heart attacks, Susan. I told you. Did you unplug your oxygen? You need it. Your oxygen levels are so low. I don't need oxygen, Susan. Not when you're around. 
Treat me like white teeth. Don't get me dirty. That's it. I'm resigning. <laughs> I can't breathe! I can't breathe, Susan! Mm, I'm in love with Timmy. Here, do the flower test. Yummy! No, don't eat it. To know if Timmy really loves you, you must do the flower test. Flower test? You must rip off each individual petal saying he loves me, he loves me not. If the final petal lands on he loves you, then he loves you. If the last petal lands on he does not, then he doesn't. He loves me, he loves me not. He loves me, he loves me not. He loves me. He loves me not. Sweetie, what's wrong? Timmy doesn't love me. Why didn't Daddy come to pick me up at school too? He went to pick up milk. He's never coming back. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. Hello, daughter. Dad? I'm sorry I left. I want to be in your life again. Ten years later and you want to be back in my life? Only if the flower says you really love me. He loves me? He loves me not. He loves me? He loves me not. You don't love me, Dad. Of course I love you. You're my daughter. Why'd you come back? Look, I need some money. I just need you to ask your mother. Not gonna happen. Why don't you go pick up milk like you said you were going to 10 years ago? Hey, baby. Are you okay? I love you. He loves me. He loves me not. He loves me. I love you too. I now pronounce you husband and... Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? I now pronounce you husband and... Wait. I need you to do the flower test. Right now? Yes, I have to be sure. She loves me. She loves me not. She loves me. She loves me not. You don't love me. Why would you agree to marry me if you don't love me? I thought I did, but I wasn't sure. No. You knew. Because if you really loved me, you wouldn't even have to think about it. Truthfully, there's someone else. <gasps> I'm sorry. Well, that was embarrassing. I love you, Timmy. Brianna, I love you too. I've loved you since I was six years old. What? But I did the flower test and you didn't love me back. It must have been wrong. Try it again. The flower test doesn't lie. Please, just one more time. He loves me. He loves me not. Mommy? Did you win us any food today? No, I lost again, darling. I'll have to try again tomorrow. But mommy, I'm starving. We haven't eaten in days. What about Sissy? Did she play? I did, but I lost. Unfortunately, we can only play once a day. I can play. No, you can't. You're too young. I'm old enough. I can play in the Hunger Games. Let her try and win some food. I'll come with her. Okay, you can go. I know you're very hungry. You can try and win us all some food, but be careful. People are very hostile when they're hungry. I'm here to play a game for food. Welcome. You'll be playing against Miss Turner. Listen here, little brat. I got family to feed. I'm not losing. Miss Turner, you better watch yourself. The game you will be playing is Rock, Paper, Scissors. Begin. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors. scissors. I chose paper. Scissors beats paper. Here's your food. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Guys, I got time kids to feed. You guys, I got time kids to feed. Miss Turner, that is not your food to touch. <laughs> sissy, close your eyes. Here, give me the food. I'll hold it for you. You sissy. Don't touch food that doesn't belong to you. <gasps> Why would you do that? That was my sister. I'm here to play a game for food. Your opponent is Derek. The game assignment says. Simon says. Touch your head. Derek, be quiet. I can't hear him. Touch your. Derek. No, 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 no. He didn't say Simon says. Derek is the winner. Yes! You cheated, Derek! Now I can't eat today! Did you win your game today? I lost. They made a new rule that you can play for food more than once a day. But if you lose your second try, you die. Please promise me you won't play more than once a day. Yeah, Mom. I promise. Brianna? Timmy? Did you win any food today? I lost. I lost my game, too. How about you and I play again and face each other in the Hungry Games? I'm in. Where's Susan? Miss Applewood is crying again. <sighs> Just put on a 60 second video with a video of someone playing with slime next to it. That's a very niche request. It works every time, trust me. 
All right, everyone, who's ready to take their vitamins? Three, two, one. All, All I go enjoyment. enjoyment. I'm sad again. <sighs> I don't get paid enough for this. Mr. Stevens, it's time to eat your lunch. You got puree mashed potatoes and puree beef. And then I don't know what that is. Why would I need a meal when I have a snack right in front of me? <laughs> Treat me like white cheese. Don't get me dirty. Fine. Don't eat. Oh, he ate. All right, so I'm just going to check your heartbeat. Ah! What's wrong? Your heart's not beating. Your heart's not beating. No! Sorry about that. I was holding it backwards. Relax. You're in hands. Don't you mean I'm in good hands? No. That's not where my heart is. Oh, my bad. I get my left and right mixed up all the time. This side. Okay. Next, we're just going to check your blood pressure. All right, relax. Relax. Breathe. Stop breathing. Breathe. Don't breathe. Why aren't you breathing? Breathe! <sighs> so your blood pressure is very high. Have you been stressed recently? I wasn't until I came in here. Mm, okay, so it's recent. Don't write that down. Can you give me a foot massage? Oh, no. Grandma, I really wish I could, but I really gotta get to school. Oh, no. I am always on the dinner table, but you don't get to eat me. What am I? Grandma, you have three tries to guess it right, or else... This is an easy one. Feet! No, Grandma, your feet should never be on the table. My dad just... No, Grandma, it's something you put food on. My hand! Thank goodness she's gone. She was giving me a headache. Grandpa! How could you say that about Grandma? I live in the ocean. I can live for a very long time. I'm a very large mammal. What am I? A large mammal? That's your grandma! Grandpa! <laughs> a dolphin? A shark? A whale? I got it. You sure it wasn't your grandma? <laughs> grandpa! I have two hands, but I cannot scratch myself. What am I? <laughs> your grandmother! Honey, did you just use the bathroom? <laughs> No. Oh no, you aged. You were lying. You can't ever lie because every time you lie, you get older. Look, I dyed my hair green. Ah! It looks really good. It doesn't look like I've aged. Hey, Eugene, I didn't do the homework. Can you give me all the answers? Brianna, are you trying to cheat? No. Hey, Sophie, I've lied twice today and I haven't aged at all. I think I'm immune. No way. You're so lucky. Hey, Timmy. You're handsome. Thanks, Brianna. That's so nice of you. And Jimmy, those are really nice shoes. Really? You think so? I've said so many lies today, and I haven't aged at all. Look in the mirror. Ah! Seriously? Only 10 lives today? I'm not going to have enough money to buy anything. Sweetie, wait. You must remember to never overspend your lives, because if you spend more lives than you have, you'll die. Of course, Mom. I already know that. Hey, girl. Hey. How many lives did you get today? I only got 10 today. Well, you still got more than me. I only have one life. No way, you're broke. I know, it's so unfair. Look at Timmy over there. He gets millions of lives every single day. He's so rich. How is it even possible? I'd like to buy this, please. That'll cost you nine lives. Are you serious? Why does it cost so much? Don't blame me, blame inflation. Do you still want it or not? Okay, fine, I'll take it. I'm starving. Oh, my bad. It actually cost 10 lives. I need one more life. What?